Hey there guys, and uh, we're back, and I finally had some sleep, and I am good, so let's get right into the video. Oh my god, oh, I got a whole bunch of eye crusts, <sighs> whatever, but I pretty much went through the event with Lola where we get, um, where we get the wool undies, because it's basically the same as we've ever seen, sure, um, first off. Where is it? It should be. Where is it? 30 XP. Oh my god. Okay, got the weapon. Where is experience? I got some before. I just went through the event where you get. So, we have arrived. This place is already freezing, and we're just standing at the entrance. Oh, score! Someone must have dropped these capes on the floor. They haven't been dropped. It is obvious they were deliberately placed here. Same difference. I'm gonna carve out my fate through sheer willpower, you know. So taking these capes in the name of carving fate will be a piece of cake. What are you talking about? That logic makes no sense at all. Neither does this game's logic. If you feel like complaining, you don't need to wear one. That won't be necessary. I shall wear one. Really? Whatever. Um... Da -da -da. You're so frustrating! Let's do this. My turn. Let's do this. Flame assault. Shooting Let's flame go, Aaron. Assault. Next. That was nothing. Not much weapon points we can get here, I guess. Whatever. I just want to increase my combo to at this point. Let's do this. My turn. Next. Let's do this. My turn. Let's see. Oh yeah, I forgot. We have mute on, so we can't really do much. Let's do this. Yeah. My turn. Next. Oh my. Was that it? Yeah. <laughs> Here I come. Let's do this. Really? Executing flame assault. There we go. Next. My turn. Ha! My turn. Yeah! Let's do this. Bang! Next! That was nothing. Not getting many weapon weapon points as I like, but whatever. We're a lot better off than last time, but this place is still freezing! Man, it's so cold. I was a lot happier before I walked into this cave. I've never seen such terrible goosebumps. I'm pretty sure I could use them a great ginger. I could really use a warm bowl of udon soup with lots of ginger right about now. Same here. I don't even want to eat it. I just want to swim in it. At yes. least this wool underwear is keeping my ass warm. I know, right? These undies are amazing! Hey! Don't stick your hands down your pants! So warm. Gross! Keep those hands away from me! Hey, Tiara. You've been awfully quiet. Is something wrong? Please, 
Don't mind me. That nasally voice. You were all... I've never had a runny nose before. But your nose is totally leaking, isn't it? Let me see your face. <laughs> How rude of you. Stop making such false accusations. <laughs> then why are you looking down, huh? It's dangerous to walk around with your head down. You are so annoying. Stop wasting energy on such pointless remarks. Fine. Slip and fall. See if I care. Okay, there's an item nearby. Somewhere over there, but... Bingo. Finders keepers! Oh, right. And then there's this. Here I come! Let's do this! Executing sh my turn. Okay, so past this part, I haven't seen anything. Um, that's right. um, after the waterfall. Not the far, far, far. That, 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 that. It was the scenes past the um, past the volcano area. I've seen that, but I haven't seen what happens in here. Let's do this. Let's do this. Fair eyes. Next. My turn. I know we're, I already know this isn't gonna be strong enough to defeat anything. Or maybe it is. Bum, 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 bum. Oh my, was that it? She actually was useful for a fight. No, seriously, she's usually not that good. Even though her parameters kind of suck right now. Eh, flash sa saucer, shell storm, giga blow. We're high, do I want to get it? I mean, it prevents me from ever getting um, ambushed again, which might actually work, I guess. Oh, shit. I forgot, Tiara. Need that healing. Is this over here? Okay. Not many item drops, I'll tell you that much. keeping your head down, you wouldn't have slipped and fell. I wasn't keeping my head down. It is just a coincidence that I slipped on some ice. Yeah, yeah. After we get out of this cave, we should buy an ice pack for Tiara's butt. Right, Fang? She's just asking to get pimp slap. We're all gonna need ice packs if we let our guard down. Here comes the boss. Was there supposed to be sound effects behind Let's that? Do this. Ha, My turn. Uh, energy crisp. Uh, high ether, I guess. Let's do this. <laughs> Flame assault. Executing flame assault. I'll cut you. <laughs> the fury broke. Damn it, Aaron. Are you all right? Uh, uh, 
Uh oh. This enemy is definitely stronger than the last time we fought him. Uh, that's true, but it seems you pushed the fury too hard. It couldn't withstand the way you fight, Bang. It just doesn't have enough fighting spirit. You should be ashamed of yourself, you lousy fury. Uh, I think we're gonna need those ice packs after all. Both of you, now is not the time for jokes. If the fury is broken, then so is the bond that links the fencer to their fairy. It's impossible for you to fight right now. Please run. I shall handle this fight. There's no way I'm running. You're already worn out. You may be unharmed, but Aaron is grievously wounded. It is a fencer's duty to care for the well-being of their fairy. <laughs> is Tiara actually worried about me? Now I've seen everything. Bang! Fang! There's no way I'm going down from that attack. Fang, watch out! No! Aaron, you idiot, get out of the way! I'll protect you this time, Fang! Hmm? Music change. Is this Aaron's power? It seems so. Bang! Can you move? My body feels so light. <laughs> I feel like I can fly. Let's do this. I believe I can fly. Aaron's fury comp uh fury uh Aaron's fury is powered up. Uh fury form has increased. Never looking back. So this is one of the songs I found on the soundtrack when I was making the intro for this game. This is friggin' annoying. And uh Let's do yeah. this. It's not bad, but it's not my It's a good song for the Fury forms, I guess. Not my I'm not the biggest fan of it though. Um, ah crap. I forgot about TR. It's not over yet. Um the yeah, Thanks me Fury Form. Not a big fan of the uh, musical change because I like the full contract. But this is not a bad change. It's not bad, but it's not my favorite. Let's do this. Next. I knew I was strong. I'm even stronger now. <laughs> I've become stronger. She skipped two levels. You did pretty good, Aaron. I didn't know you had this new power. Well, I have a piece of the goddess's power. If I decide to get serious, I'm capable of all kinds of things. I can lay your knees. I can't believe you activated it at exactly the right time. I was so annoyed that Tiara was worried about me that I just powered up. Like any shonen anime. Which means I am the reason you were able to power up at all. You both owe me a sizable life debt. What? You're the one who owes me! I saved you, remember? Yep. Yes, thanks to me. You said so yourself. I didn't literally say thanks to Tiara, you ingrate. You guys are so damn loud. You may say mean things to each other, but you're still helping each other grow. That's what being friends is all about. No matter your differences or how much you both argue, you help each other out in times of need, even if you don't want to. Why is Fang the voice of reason right now? Fang, that's a really nice thing to say about us, but... Please stop warming your hands inside <laughs> your pants! <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I do that sometimes too when it's really cold. But it's like, I like the cold, but then like I don't want my hands to freeze. I need to get a pop filter for this thing. Uh, let's see. Sigurd. Hmm. That's Harley. Oh, it's just like in the last timeline where she was just freaking stalking us. Uh, applause title for Lola. Got some, got some special stuff. Fury info. Eh. 
Thank you very much. Soul planes. Okay, so I can just go down there and go get the fury from over there um, before I actually progress the story. Or, actually, let's go, because I think we get Harley after this. Man, I'm tired. And hungry. I'm craving something sweet, actually. Then your wish is granted. Hey, it's Bahas. Whoa! Look at all these sweets! Did someone summon a dessert genie or what? No, it's just called having a Bahas. Why, hello there. Sorry to bother you. Harley! But hmm? Why do you know my name? Ah, uh, well, um, despite my looks, I'm actually interested in researching fairies, and, um, that's why I know who you are? I see. You're interested, huh? Wh what Oh, uh, just so we're clear, I'm not stalking you, or anything. You just made it worse. You're silly. Of course I don't think you're a stalker. Because she actually has brains, and Tiara literally just kept calling you a stalker because you knew her name. <laughs> She's not the type to get stalkers. Bullshit, man. I literally have like a whole bunch of Harley photos on my hard drive. She spends her days locked inside a pigsty of a room doing research and eating junk food. Sally, pretty much that's my entire life beside uh, replace research with drawing and playing video games on the internet. Anyway, where did you get that cape? Oh, I found it earlier. I'm pretty grateful for that, actually. I left that cape, but it's alright. You can have it if you want. So, this cape was yours, huh? What were you doing at the Catechus Ice Caves, then? Oh, me? I was... It's noisy in here. Did something happen? Oh, it's Harley and Old Ben Bahas! Oh my, you know about me too? Hey, I'm not an old man. <laughs> Fang, do you and Aaron know these people? This is gonna get complicated, so butt out. Go on, shoo, shoo! Shooing me away like a bothersome insect? <sighs> Sadly, I don't know why, but I like the side of Tiara. I don't know why. I need... I, I don't know why. Oh well, if you know who I am, that makes this easier. I'm Harley, a fairyologist. This is my fairy partner, Bahas. I'm sorry for waiting in your room like this to ambush you. I actually want to ask you for a favor. Yeah, sure. Anyway, is it cool if I eat these desserts? You don't mind, right? Thanks for the food! And thumbnail. No fair, Aaron! That one's mine! <laughs> it's so delicious! This custard slice has the perfect amount of whipped cream! The fruits are so fresh and the texture just melts in my mouth! What is this, food porn or Shokeki no Soma? Mm, um, this tiny cake thing is much tastier! Oh, the outside is perfectly cooked, and the inside is overflowing with thick, juicy chocolate! <laughs> the gooeyness of the chocolate mixed with the moist outside is totally amazing! Hey, you guys! You mustn't eat food that doesn't belong to you without permission! Then what the fuck are you doing right now? And where in the world did you learn to be food critics? That's great to hear. All that baking was worth it just to see your happy faces. God, we need a Bajas in the U.S. Or like, yeah, at where I work. We need like th like ten Bajases. Whenever I cook for Harley, she's never impressed. Unfortunately, I have no sense of taste. Hey, fancy lady, feel free to help yourself. I don't mind. Fancy lady? Really? Well, if you insist... I just realized that looking in the bottom right, like Huey's looking like, "Hey, give me some food, give me some food, Huey." <laughs> just so you know, this tiny cake thing is mine. Mine, I say. Then I shall try some macaroons. Oh. How are they? Amazing! It tastes so delicious. As if my stomach has been reunited with an old friend! Well, sir, I'm quite picky about what goes in my dishes, and I go out of my way to not use harmful ingredients. <laughs> really? I didn't know that. What? Really? Jeez, you don't know what you're missing! Oh, man, it's so good! Yep, yep! 
I totally wouldn't mind repeating this moment over and over again. It's strange, though. Whatever happened to Dorfus' dinner party? Man, you're so rude. Do you think about food all the time? Bitch, what the hell are you talking about? That's not what I mean. We met Harley after we met Lord Sherman at Dorfus' party. Oh, yeah, that's right. Tiara, have you received an invitation to a party from the, uh, Dorfa Corporation? No, I haven't received any invitation. Maybe it's because of how Sherman's changed in this dimension that he's not involved with Dorfa. I heard the party Dorfa was planning to throw got cancelled. What do you mean? Hmm, there's only one explanation I can think of. The exact moment we traveled back in time became the singularity. Because of that, the past events leading up to that singularity are beginning to change. Well, at least this makes some kind of sense. <sighs> Sorry to interrupt, but is it alright if I explain what I'm doing here? Talking's free, so talk away. <laughs> Thanks. Apparently there's a fury at the Zawaza Plains, but it's being guarded by one of Dorfa's executives. The Zawaza Plains? She must be talking about Apollonius. You know about him, too? Jeez, you guys have good connections. Well, I've said pretty much everything I want to say. Let's all team up so we can collect that fury. Why do I have to do that? I'll pass. Thanks. We'll do it. We must cross this unavoidable path if we are going to revive the goddess. Yeah, I knew this was going to happen. I don't mind going to the Zawaza Plains, but what's your deal, Harley? You're not doing this just out of kindness, right? I'm a fencer, too. Dorfa looks like they're up to no good, so I'd rather see you kids collect the Furies. For the sake of world peace and all that. Of course, that's not entirely accurate, either. You guys were at the Catechus Ice Cave yesterday, right? Yeah? I have a device for measuring the energy output of fairies, and it recently recorded an unprecedented amount of energy. I was interested in finding out what kind of fairy could produce such power, so I went searching for the one responsible. Is that... she's probably talking about when Fang and I returned to the past. Or maybe when we actually fixed our fury. By coincidence, I saw you guys coming just as I was planning to investigate inside the Catechus Ice Cave. I'd never seen your faces before, so my curiosity was piqued. Shortly after, my device recorded another demonstration of enormous fairy energy coming from inside the cave. Your device must have recorded the moment Aaron's power forced the broken fury to evolve. Evolve, huh? That's very interesting. The reading wasn't as big as the one from the other day, but it was still impressive. I got even more curious about what kind of fairy could produce such energy, so I followed after you guys. And that led me here, to this inn. Also, I left those capes behind because I saw you guys weren't wearing much. It was my way of helping you out a little. Wow, that was nice of you. <laughs> you know, now that I think about it, does that mean you were stalking us the whole time? Ugh, I'd say that's typical Harley behavior, but I'm a little scared. She's just interested in me, right? <laughs> Come here, little fairy. I don't bite. But I do. For some reason, her eyes seem way scarier than they did before. All jokes aside, I just want to study that fairy's power up close. Honestly, I don't really care about world peace or doing what's right. Would you mind if someone like me tagged along with you? Yes, we need, we, we need your assets in battle and in bed. Not at all. Um, how should I put this? I'm already used to it. If Bang okays it, then I guess it's settled. Thanks. I'm happy to hear that. It's refreshing to see enthusiastic eaters for a change. For sure. I hope we get along, Pops. We need to be careful if we're gonna go up against Dorfa. Anyway, what's your fairy's name, Thang? Aaron. Aaron, huh? It'd be bad if something happened to you. I'd better thoroughly examine that pretty body of yours. You're very interesting, Aaron. You're gonna have to show me how deep this rabbit hole goes. <laughs> oh, get away from me, you quack! This has certainly taken a turn for the bazaar. He's only gonna experiment on Aaron, though. We still get to enjoy Bajas' free food. 
My condolences, Aaron. <laughs> Ali is doing the party. 